we're just gonna have to put our heads together and think of something new. Between you and me, we'll find the plan B or C or D. Between me and you, we'll get this delivery through. I've got an idea. Sugar and flour will be our base stacked up right. Make a pretty sweet race, keeping eggs, milk, and butter in the right place. is a fine how do you do? Hi, Gordon. Everything okay? No. Thomas and I are delivering ties to the bottom of the mine, but my headlight just burned out. I can't join him without it. Oh, well, I can help you. Stick close to me. I'll light the way. Thank you, Nia, but do be careful. This mine can be a dangerous place. <laughs> Watch out, Nia! A runaway car! Um, Gordon? It's your car. In my car? Oh, yeah, we have to catch it. Go oh, this way. Here. Ah, there it is. Whoa. Oh, we're getting close. Come on. Ooh. Oh, I forgot how beautiful the Crystal Cavern is. It's incredible. Oops. Yeah, this mine is quite spooky enough without that, Nia. <laughs> Thank you very much. Sorry, this is just a little setback. I think your car ended up over here. Whoa. What was that? One of the crystals. It lit up. Whoa! <gasps> Come on! The crystal cavern is gonna help us find your car and get out. Um. Uh... Ding, ding, dong, ding. <laughs> Whoa! We found my car! Yes! Um... What are you doing? <laughs> Dancing! Look! <gasps> Let me try! I think we just might dance our way to a delivery. Oh, yeah! Thanks for the help loading, Carly. No problem, Cranky. Loading Volstrode is fun. Watch this, Sandy. Ugh. Nice lift, Carly. Maybe one day you'll be as strong as Cranky. As strong as me? <laughs> I don't think so. Oh, yeah? Well, how about this? That's a pretty big load, Carly. That was pretty big, Cranky. Can you top it? Of course I can. Look at this. <laughs> Whoa, take it easy now. Wow. How are you going to beat that one, Carly? Hmm. That's nothing. How about this? Huh? Excuse me. What's happening? I'm... How about this? Oh, yeah? Hmm. Hey, Carly, do this one next. Whoa! Get me down from here! I'll get you, Sandy. I am not happy about this. Oh no, Bullstrode! Oh, sorry, pal. Whoa! Was that really necessary? No, it was not. But it was amazing. 
Yeah, enough playing around. Let's work together. It doesn't have to be a contest. Oh, no. Now what have we done? I got this. I guess our lifting contest was a tie. <laughs> Come on! Oh, lovely! Our passengers have never seen anything like this before. Oh, awesome! We are almost to the seashore. No more dark tunnels. Nope. Nothing but beautiful scenic countryside. Huh? <gasps> the bridge is up! And no electricity to bring it down. What will we do? Connor, dear, can you do something? Connor, are you able to connect to the bridge like you did to the tunnel? Electric idea! Let's find out! I can plug in and power the bridge. No power, no problem. Something wrong? <sighs> the bridge is down. But now, so is my battery. I'm out of power. It's okay. Go on to Vickerstown. I'll be fine. Grab on, Kana. Everything's connected, right? Now you're connected to me, and I'm going to Vickerstown. Way to go, Purse! On the left is the Vickerstown Lighthouse. It's dark right now, but when it's lit up, it's... <gasps> Spectacular! Incredible! Just beautiful. Thank you. We definitely got our scenic route, as promised, Thomas. Well, the electricity's all connected, but so are we. We all did it together. Yep! <laughs> I'm sure this tour will be the highlight of their visit. Oh, oh, Annie, I made a pun. Oh, you did. Good one, Clary. Hi there. I'm all charged up and ready to go. Come on. Why don't we all connect for the ride home? Hook me in. I'll lead the way. Electric! <laughs> You'll never catch me, dragon! <laughs> Bet you can't catch me, dragon! <laughs> oh no! Look out! <gasps> the dragons! Running away? Come on, knights! Let's catch that dragon! Huzzah! Hmm? Huh? Must be my incredibly vivid imagination again. <laughs> oh, of course, it's just a dragon. A dragon? Run away! Ah! Dragon sighting! There! This way, knights! To the rescue! Ah! Help! This way, knight. <laughs> ah! 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 I got you, James. We're here to rescue you from the dragon float. Save yourselves and... What? Dragon captured! We're playing dragon. And it got away from us. I see.
Well, perhaps this time one of you can be the dragon and I'll be the handsome and almost unbearably charming knight. I'll be the dragon this time. Dragon? There's a dragon! Run away! Run away! Roar! Come, Knight Kara. Let's save the kingdom from the beast! Lead the way! Lead the way! <laughs> this is fun! What are we doing? <laughs> Chasing a butterfly. Oh, I love butterflies. They're so delicate, but keep fluttering and flitting and flying. I know. Right now, I'm looking for a Sodor skipper. A Sodor skipper? I thought we were looking for butterflies. We are. A Sodor skipper is a really big purple butterfly. Purple? Like me? Electric. Hmm. Not here. <gasps> Over there. It's amazing. <laughs> They get scared easily. Maybe they're just not ready for someone as fast as you. Good point. I won't go fast. <gasps> that one over there is purple! It is a Sodor Skipper! Well, it was. Maybe she heard you coming? <laughs> I might have been too loud. Okay. So we need to be slow and quiet. <gasps> Look over there! Where? Slowly, slowly, getting closer, closer. <gasps> so beautiful! <gasps> so perfectly purple! <gasps> Look out! <gasps> <laughs> I guess no matter how slow or how quiet we are, we're always going to scare away the Sodor Skippers. But it sure was fun looking. There's one on your head. head. Electric. This rocks. Taking letters and packages down the rail. My favorite thing is to deliver the mail. <laughs> Papers. You're looking excited today. Just one delivery left. It's a super special party balloon for Sir Topham Hat. Look! Oh no! It's getting away! I have to get that back. Come on! Back up! Back up, back up, back up! Go, go, go! I have to get that back! There it is! I got it! I don't got it. Hey! Come back here! We have to get it back, or Sir Topham Hat's party will be ruined! Follow that seagull! Well, hello there. Excuse me, Cranky. Well, you lift me up to those gulls. I suppose so. Percy, you're scared of heights! What are you doing? I have to deliver all the mail. That means getting my... Okay, let's deliver this balloon. Come on, Loco Amigo. I got you. Sir Topham Hat, your special party balloon. Oh, yes, perfect. Thank you. I'll add it to the others. The others? There. Lovely. Oh, oh dear. Boys, would you mind? Follow that, Sir Topham Hat. Oh, my. Don't worry, Sir Topham Hat. We'll get you back to the party. If you jump out of your hiding place and surprise me, you win. But if I sneak up and surprise you, I win. That's why it's called Hide and Surprise! Okay, I'll hide first. Ready or not, here I come to surprise you. Surprise! Yay, yay, yay! It's your turn to hide. Oh, I'm going to hide, all right. Somewhere Percy will never find me. Surprise! Ah! Ah! Sorry, but it's hide and surprise, remember? I love this game. 
Percy will never find me in here. <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> He'll never find me here. Surprise! <laughs> <laughs> Diesel's undercover. Surprise! Ah! Surprise! Ah! Ooh! <laughs> the perfect hiding place. Surprise! Ah! He's not gonna surprise me this time. I'm gonna surprise him. Ha ha ha! Nailed it! Surprise! Ah! Diesel? That was great! Surprise! <laughs> Let's roll! Hey! My wheel is loose! Yeah, so loose! <laughs> <laughs> no cracks, bolts tight, no wobble. No problem. Come on, guys. It's a long way to Harwood. Oh, I don't want to do this. We've got something else. Thomas, I think my axle is cracked. The cracked axle is terrible. Yeah, except the axles are fine. <laughs> well, my boiler is leaking. Boxcars don't have boilers. True, but my underpins are overpin. That's not a thing. No more delays. Let's go. Aw, a bolt. Thomas, your coupler's loose. No, you've been checked and rechecked. But it's for real this time. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, oh, I blame myself. I blame you, too. <laughs> You guys were pretending again that my coupler was broken. Your coupler broke? Oh, that's bad. But we'll fix it. Now you, I believe, Sandy. I told you not to pretend you were broken. Well, you pretended your wheel was broken first. Well, you pretended you had a leaky boiler. But cars don't have boilers. Next time, let's just go. It's okay, Percy. Everyone's afraid a little. But some of us are afraid a lot. Me, for a start, I'm afraid of the dark and pandas and great white sharks. You're afraid of pandas? They're bears, Nia. Panda bears. Yeah, but they're really more like raccoons. Oh, raccoons are so cute. OK, so never mind. I like pandas now. Everyone's afraid a little, even if someone says, me personally, my fear happens to be roller coasters. They scare me a lot. Coasters are just like pandas. The more you know, the less afraid you'll be. We all get scared. It's a feeling that's shared of robots or ghosts or bats or vacuum cleaners.
comes a laugh and it isn't far to go Till you're rolling on the ground Will you laugh along? No The last trap worth you just got Thomas and Percy. Howdy, fellas. Over. Harold! Harold the helicopter? Wow, it's so cool to see you. <laughs> Roger that. Right back at you. Over. First mate Percy, 
We're coming to a fork in the, uh, the ocean. Let's go left, toward the cows. I think he really wants you to look at them cows. <laughs> <laughs> they are nice cows. Well, I got a delivery at the docks. Over and out. Bye, Harold. See you soon. Aw, can't hear me over his rotors. <laughs> I couldn't hear you either. His rotors are loud. Harold is amazing, though. Absolutely. But we need a way to communicate so we'll understand each other if it gets loud again. Even if it's loud, our whistles are louder. How's this? One peep will mean yes, and two will mean no. Great. And one long peep or two for faster, and two for slower. Right. Got it. And four quick blasts if you want to go super fast, and a blast and a half if you want to go like a little bit faster, and also three quick peeps if you want to stop. And then, stop. If then, you want to get then. That's a lot to remember. So you good? Well, great. Let's get back on track. Um. First mate Percy, let's go fast through that tunnel. One long peep. Okay, that was one long peep. That means go faster. <coughs> he understood me. Okay, let's do this. <gasps> the bridge is up. We need to stop. That's three peeps. Huh? What did 12 peeps mean? Maybe Percy can't hear me on the other side of the mountain. I gotta try something else. Oh. Huh? Oh, fun! Thomas sent up a stop signal. A stop signal? Stop! <laughs> Phew. Dum dee 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 dum. Another quiet day on the river of Thomas. So, so quiet. Is the telescope here yet? Not yet. Bulstrode should be here any. <gasps> Thomas, what happened? What do you mean? Ah! Thomas, I told you not to cut through Crumble Canyon. So that's what you said. I knew it was something like that. You look terrible. Like, really terrible. Huh? Pfft. I just got a little dinged up. No biggie. Thomas, what on earth? You have to get to Tidmouth right now. Right now? But I want to see the new telescope. You no know, buts. You have to get repainted immediately. You don't want to rust, do you? Rust? I'm so glad you came to see me. You've got a bad case of the scrapes. Aww. Can't believe I'm going to miss Cranky unloading the new telescope. Scratches and dings do turn to rust if you don't fix them, Thomas. And you don't want rust, Thomas. Rust is the worst. I hear it's super itchy and scratchy and really uncomfortable. Oh, it is. You should be fine, Thomas. See, got you all fixed up with a fresh new coat of paint. Good as new. Great. Thanks, Sandy. Hey. Sorry, switching right. But this isn't my shortcut. No, but uh, you'll see. This way is much better. But it will take us twice as long. No! Cole's farm is way out of our way. I gotta get back across Crovins Creek and into the forest. Hmm. Oh, uh, Gordon. I heard you delivered all the cement for the ferry terminal at Norrenby by yourself. That can't be true, can it? 
It can, and it is. <clears throat> it was no small job, let me tell you. All the cement had to be delivered in one night, and no other engines were available. Well, everyone said it couldn't be done, but I said it's blocked. This is definitely the way to go. To well, by that time, I had delivered only half the cement. It was almost morning. Time was running out, so I dug in and... What? Why are we in the forest? These bricks have to be delivered as soon as possible. Well, we'll get to Normandy much faster this way. We're not going to get there at all this way. We have to go the other way. I insist. Switching right. Hey! Break it! Whoa. Oh, my brain! Thomas, wait! See? We're crossing Quick Draw Bridge. Yes, but we're crossing it in the wrong direction. Now look, there's the big windmill. This is definitely the way to go. Uh, no. You're thinking of the other windmill. Back into the forest is the way to go. What are you doing? I'm taking us the new way. But this is not the right way. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. No, it isn't. Go left! No, go right! Huh? Thomas? What are you doing over there? Whoa! Uh-oh. Oh, Thomas, I, I might need some assistance here. I'm coming, Gordon! Stop wandering off like that! I'm doing my best, Gordon! And we're back on track! Uh-oh. Everything okay, Tom? Yo! Oh, the tracks are closed! Stop! Phew! That was close! It's not treasure, it's... A monster! Roar! Ah! <laughs> it's got big teeth, but it's not a monster. The paleontologist says it's a dinosaur. What's a palonapotogalist? Palonapotogalist, Diesel. <laughs> a paleontologist is a scientist who learns about dinosaurs by digging up their bones. I love dinosaurs. This is so cool. Oh, yes. And even cooler, uh, they need some engines to deliver the bones to the Vickerstown Museum for the big new dinosaur exhibit. Sounds like a job for the Biggest Adventure Club. Yeah! Hooray! Guys, guys, we have to go to the mine. Right now, there's bones. Bones? Dinosaur bones! Dinosaur bones? Wahoo! Let's go! Yeah! Uh, let's go! Yeah! Yeah! Follow me! Yes. How Wait fun! For me. I love dinosaurs! Me too! I'm Neosaurus! Hear me roar! <laughs> Call me the Perseodactyl! The Conoraptor will show you how it's done. Thomas Rex has got this! Let's go! <laughs> See? The bones are right. <gasps> oh no! Gordon, the T Rex is gone? Gone? Someone better tell the Paleo Lollipopolis. <laughs> the uh, paleontologist dug them up from there and carefully arranged them for you over here. Now, everyone pick a car, but keep them in the order they are now. Feet, tailbone, ribs, and claws, head and jaws. Oh! For the T Rex to be put together properly, the paleontologists put these cars in this exact order. If you get out of order. Got it! Dinosaurs, let's dino roar! Roar! <laughs> if you 
kids get out of order, T-Rex won't look right. Uh, Thomas? Thomas! <sighs> Feet, tailbone, ribs, and claws, head and jaws. Feet, tailbone, ribs, and claws, head and jaws. Stomp and bite and swipe and roar! Feet, tailbone, ribs, and claws, head and jaws. Whoa, so big, but we can handle it. You sure about that, Thomas? We know what to do at railway crossings. Stop, look, and listen. Hey, guys. Sorry I'm late. Hi, Diesel. It's okay. You can bring the tractor. What? That tiny tractor? Ugh. See you there. Okay, steady and safe. And fun. How about a game? Red light, green light. Green light. <laughs> steady and safe. Whoa! <laughs> Thanks, Cranky. Just be careful out there. Thomas, listen! Look! Mia! <gasps> Red light! <laughs> Duckies, don't you know it's not safe to play on the railway tracks? Now scoot. Green light! I love this game. Hi, Ducks! Red light! Green light! No! <laughs> nice try. <laughs> Diesel, you okay? Never better. Diesel, you have to pay attention at railway crossings. When the crossing barriers are down, you have to stop. And never try to cross when a train is coming. Green light! Green light! From now on, I'm gonna be super safe. Huh? Ah! Red light! Looks like somebody left the gate open and the cows wandered onto the tracks. Bad move. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna chug. I'm gonna chew. I've got a delivery to do. Up hills, down hills, around each bend. Taking this cargo to the end. I'm gonna chug. I'm gonna chew. There's got to be a way for me to get in front of you. I'm gonna chug. I'm gonna chew. I'm almost up to you. Up hills, down hills, around each bend. Taking this cargo to the end. I'm gonna jug. I'm gonna chew. I've got a delivery to do. Up hills, down hills, around each bend. Taking this cargo to the end. I'm gonna chuck. I'm gonna chew. There's got to be a way for me to get in front of you. Cranky. Loading Bullstrode is fun. Watch this, Sandy. Ugh. Nice lift, Carly. Maybe one day you'll be as strong as Cranky. As strong as me? <laughs> I don't think so. Oh, yeah? Well, how about this? That's a pretty big load, Carly. That 
was pretty big, Cranky. Can you top it? Of course I can. Look at this. Uh, Whoa, take it easy now. Wow. How are you going to beat that one, Carly? Hmm. That's nothing. How about this? <laughs> Excuse me. What's happening? I'm... Uh, How about this? Oh, yeah? Hmm. Hey, Carly, do this one next. Whoa! Get me down from here! I'll get you, Sandy. Ooh, I'm good. <laughs> I am not happy about this. Oh, no! Bulstrode! Oh, sorry, pal. Whoa! Was that really necessary? No, it was not. But it was amazing. Ah, enough playing around. Let's work together. It doesn't have to be a contest. <laughs> oh, no. Now what have we done? I got this. I guess our lifting contest was a tie. <laughs> I thought being number one was done so easily. Just gotta be strong when the load is heavy, revved up and at the ready. Faster than any other train, shiny with the glossy coat of paint. Taking the lead in a big delivery. This is all. Number one's not easy as it seems. You've got to be willing to offer your help. Put others before yourself. Know when you should apologize. Be honest, loving, and kind. Now I can see a brighter side of me. A true friend to all is how a number one engine should be.
Thomas, you sure are speedy. That was amazing. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. Number one, lots of fun. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. <gasps> Come on. It's probably okay. Don't blow a gasket. Maybe we can fix it before Gordon gets here. I'm <gasps> here. Well, how did your deliveries go, hmm? Are all of the lights safe and not broken? I, um, well, you see... <sighs> Gordon, the truth is... The tracks were bumpy! <laughs> what? They were. But that's not how it broke. Well, this is a problem. <laughs> but <laughs> accidents happen. <laughs> Besides, the Festival of Lights will still be grand with your second light. Phew! <laughs> My second light. <gasps> Where is my second light? You, uh, you did have the second light, <laughs> correct, Thomas? Um, be right back. Come on, Thomas. These cows aren't gonna haul themselves to McCall's farm. <laughs> Let's go. Uh oh. Wait. What is it? I can't steam, and I lost my peep because I'm out of water. I'm a diesel, so I don't need water. Catch me if you can. <sighs> That's it. <laughs> Sorry, <gasps> cows, but we gotta hurt the <laughs> Rusty rail spikes. I have the hick <laughs> ups. Hey, Thomas. Is there, like, a really big chicken around here? No, it's <gasps> me. I took on water too fast, and I think I got the hiccups. <gasps> so bad, I can't do the delivery. <gasps> oh, I hear steam blasts help, like this. <gasps> that might have worked. <laughs> The cows have hiccups? <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Uh-oh. <laughs> A good surprise always cures the hiccups. It worked. It's a good thing we diesels never get hiccups. I guess we do get hiccups. Chaga, chaga, snooze, snooze. Little train so sweet. Chaga, chaga, snooze, snooze. Rest your wheels and go to sleep. Chugga, chugga, snooze, snooze. Slow your pistons, no more steam. Shut your eyes, time to dream. Chaga, chaga, snooze, snooze. It's 
such a lovely sight. Chugga, chugga, snooze, snooze. When a sleeping train goes night, night. I'd always do good deeds here to there and everywhere. Thanks to my super speed. Woohoo! If I was a super train, I'd use my super steam. I'd slip inside so I could hide and not be super seen. If you were a super train, you'd do a lot of good. But anyone can be a hero. So strong and fly so fast. Having superpowers is a super blast. Superpowers are great, it's true, but nothing's more super than just being you. If I was a super train, I'd always do good deeds here to there and everywhere. Thanks to my super speed. Woohoo! If I was a super train, I'd use my super steam. I'd slip inside so I could hide and not be super seen. If you were a super train, you'd do a lot of good. But anyone can be a hero right in their neighborhood. I'd be so strong and fly so fast. Having superpowers is a super blast. Superpowers are great, it's true. Would cheer my name. But even if you lost your powers, I'd like you just the same. Any minute now. Do you see him yet? Not yet. Uh uh. Hey guys, did any of you see that the crossing arms? Hold on, Thomas. He should be here any minute. Huh? All right. Young Bow's coming today. He's coming for the fireworks show tonight. I can't wait to see him. And that cool tiger painted on his side. And hear his whistle that sounds like a tiger. <laughs> Just like that. That must be him. Avast, landlubbers. There's a passenger on board who seems to be eager to see ya. You made it! Roar! Everyone, I'm so happy to be back with you all in Sodor. And I brought a surprise for the fireworks show tonight. All the way from China. Cool! Whoa. That's awesome! Can you tell us again how you earned your totally cool and sort of scary tiger decal? Please! Yeah. Tell us! <laughs> oh, it wasn't such a big deal. I was just trying to help out. Come on! Please, with actual yeah. grease on top! Okay, okay. It was for the time I rescued... <gasps> Annie and Clarabelle? Annie and Clarabelle? I thought you rescued an engine from an ice cliff with a snowplow. No! James is pulling Annie and Clarabelle this way. But the crossing arm is stuck, and they don't see Gordon coming. We have to stop them. Oh, yeah. Guys, I was trying to save a fort. Gordon! Gordon! Thank you, Young Bao. Nicely done. Whew. Thank you, Young Bao. So electric. Oh, you weren't How even great. scared. What's wrong, Thomas? Well, I should have been the one to have saved the day. I saw the crossing arm was stuck, and I was gonna tell someone, but... Young Bao is our hero. Did you see that? Oh, yes. So you had a chance to be brave and missed it? Yeah. I wish I could have shown Young Bao how brave I really am. Well... You may not be the bravest engine on Sodor, but you did get to see Young Bao bravely leap to the rescue. Well, I would have, too. You really are the bravest engine. 
Well, we'd better get to our delivery so we don't miss the fireworks tonight. Bye, y'all. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I can clear that, no problem. <laughs> It might be a little problem. Good luck with the traffic. Ha! Huh. It's nothing but grassy fields and blue skies out here. Right, sheep? <gasps> Cracked couplers! Where did all this traffic come from? <clears throat> you got this, Percy! I think I can. I think I can. I think I... Thanks, cow. Any chance you want to be my new BFF? Bovine friend forever? Traintastic! Although, I am a little worried about Thomas. He took the lunnies for my mail route, and you would not believe how jammed it gets this time of day. <laughs> Is the traffic always this bad? Ha ha ha! You are listening! I don't need Percy. It's just you and me, sheepy old pal. Which ain't so bad. <laughs> <sighs> Percy would have laughed at that. Who am I kidding? I miss my best friend. Thomas? Why haven't you dropped your delivery off yet? Isn't it obvious? I'm stuck in traffic. Wait, where's Percy? He uh, took a little detour. Don't tell me you two haven't made up yet. Well, he started it. Or maybe I did. I wonder if he's having as much trouble as I am. <laughs> <sighs> Thanks for trying, Cow. But it's no use. I'll never get this delivery done without my best buddy, Thomas. What am I gonna do, Nia? Why don't you just ask Percy for help? This is his mail route, after all. He'll know a way around it. I, I can't. We're not exactly friends anymore. And besides, he's probably made it to Normby without me. So if Percy was nearby, would you ask him for help? Yeah. Good, because Percy's right over there. Wait, what? Percy! <gasps> I was really hoping Thomas wouldn't see me. Can you help Thomas get out of this traffic? We're still not talking. But if someone wanted to avoid the traffic, they could back up a few feet and take the siding over there to get to this track. Thomas, it's right here. Thanks, Percy! <sighs> you both are being silly. Hey, Thomas, you got a light bulb too? Yeah, for the lighthouse. Is yours for the dance party at Brenham Docks? Yep, I can't wait. Since we're going the same way, wanna race? Last one to quick jump bridge is a broken bulb. <laughs> Diesel, the lights are too breakable. We can't race. <sighs> I better catch him and warn him. <laughs> Woohoo! Diesel, slow down. We don't want our light bulbs to break. Nice try, Thomas. You're just trying to trip me so you can win the race. <laughs> I don't need tricks to win against you. <laughs> hey, no fear. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse party, me. Party, me. Party, party, me. Was fun. Call it a tie? Sure. See you at the dance tonight. Can't wait. Who's ready to dance? I am, I am, I am, I am. That's not a dance light. It's the lighthouse light. It is. So if we have this light, that doesn't look right. <gasps> Diesel and I must have switched bulbs. The ships need the lighthouse, so we can't switch the bulbs until tomorrow. If you can't switch the light bulb, then we'll just have to switch where we have our dance party. Now this is a party. <laughs> 